Today I will show how to create a new product in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 and then release it to multiple legal entities or companies to facilitate the maintenance. First we will need to create a new product and Microsoft AX Dynamics AX 2012 offers two types of product products and product masters. Product masters can be configured while product and non-configurable -config items. In this case, we'll choose a product master. We'll click on new product and type a new product number. Like so. The system checks whether or not this item number is already used. Next, we'll type a product name. And under product variants, we'll choose the type of variant that we want to use with this product. Uh, for example, just size. So this item will come in various sizes. And click OK. Next, we'll create a sizes. I will create a few different sizes. For example, 42, 55, 65 and 72 inches. We can now view our product variant. In this case, all are various sizes. At this point, the product is not yet ready to, to be used. It only contains basic data that, that is shared across all legal entities. Next, we need to release the product and its variants to the various legal entities. To do so, I'll click on Release Product. Select the variant or variants that I want to release. So in this case, we will not release size 42. Select Companies and select the companies that we want to release the product to. This, this company and this one and maybe this one too. And click OK to release the products. This product and its variants has been released to three separate legal entities. Let's go and check one of the release products. Click on release products and select the newly created item. We can now switch to a different legal entity and verify that the product has also been released there. We will select CEE and click OK. We are now in a different legal entity and we'll click on release products. And we can verify that this product also exists in this legal entity. We optionally, we can enter company specific data under each legal entity. And this concludes this demonstration.